What's cooking guys? Do you have to manually mute all your audio layers except the one you want to hear like this? Well, you've been actually doing it wrong the whole time. There's actually a lot faster way you can do it. And that's what I'm going to show you in this video. So here I have a timeline where I have a bunch of audio layers. I have a vocal layer, a music layer, another layer of audio, and then some sound effects. A lot of the time you need to solo out just one of those layers, one of those tracks, just so you can hear it to make sure it's kind of matching up correctly. But most people will actually just go mute, 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 hit the mute button so many times just so they can hear that one track. But that's actually the wrong way to do it. You, that just takes so long, so many clicks, and then you gotta unmute it all just to play it again. And if you wanna do the other track, you have to do the same thing again. It just takes so long. There's actually one button that you can click that will just solo out that one track, and it's literally called the solo track key. And that's located right here. It's the S, the solo track button right here. And if you don't see this S, you just right click hit customize and then just pull that S on the top kind of track layer right here to give the S. If you pull it on down here, you still won't see it. You have to open it. So what you want to do is you want to customize it and pull that S on the top, hit okay. And then it will show up right here. So this S solo track button, it literally just solos out this track that I click the S on and mutes the rest without me having to mute it. So this is what it sounds like before you hear all the different layers. This is the puzzle that I love to figure out. And now if I solo it out, puzzle that I love to figure out. All I hear is the vocals. Is the puzzle that I love to figure out. And I can do that for a different track. I just want to hear the track coming underneath so I know I timed it right. And it mutes all the rest. It is that simple. No more clicking the M button a bunch of times all the way through to mute your layers just to hear one track. Just hit the solo button. It's so much easier. So that's a quick little tip for you guys. Just the solo track key. It'll save you so much time when it comes to fine tuning your audio edits. Well, I hope you guys like this video. As always, make sure you like and subscribe. Other than that, I'll see you in the next one, guys. Peace.